Hi, I'm Nate, and in this tutorial, you'll learn how to restore your backups using Dropbox. If you don't have the Dropbox app on the device, you can open Safari and go to dropbox.com and log in using your email and password, and then tap on Sign In. Then open the Apps folder, and then tap on the Prolocotigo folder, from the list of backup files stored in your Dropbox, you can choose a file you want to import by tapping on it. I'm going to tap on Nate. When asked, tap on Open and Proloquo to Go. After importing the backup, you can restore the backup now or later. For this demonstration, I'm going to tap on Restore Later. After selecting to restore a backup later, open the Options view. On the iPhone iPod Touch, tap on the Views button in the bottom left corner and then tap on Options. On the iPad, to open Options View, tap on the Gears button in the bottom right corner. Then scroll down under General Options and tap on Backup. Then tap on Restore from Backup. Tap on the backup you want to restore. To restore Nate, tap on Restore Nate. I have now successfully transferred and restored my vocabulary using Dropbox. But if you already have the Dropbox app installed in your device, just click on the app to open it, open the Apps folder, and then open the Proloquo to Go folder. Then choose the file you want to import by tapping on it and then tap on the Open In icon in the top right corner of the toolbar and tap on Open in Proloquo to Go. After importing the backup, you can restore the backup now or later. For this demonstration, I'm going to restore later. After selecting to restore a backup later, open the Options view. On an iPhone iPod Touch, tap on the Views button in the bottom left corner and then tap on Options view. On an iPad, the Options view is in the bottom right corner of the toolbar, the Gears button. Scroll down until you see General Options, tap on Backup, then tap on Restore from Backup. If you have multiple users set up in Proloquo to Go on your device, you can restore from the backups from any user on the device. Here you see the backups of a copy of Proloquo to Go that has three users. If you select a backup from a different user other than the one that is currently active, you'll be asked what to do. You can either overwrite the current user with the backup from the other user, or you can switch to that other user and restore it from the selected backup file. Here, a backup from the user Gabby has been selected, but the current active user is Nate. For this tutorial, I'm going to restore my backup Nate from Dropbox. Since Nate is the active user, all I have to do is tap on Restore Nate and it will restore my vocabulary from the Dropbox. I have now successfully transferred and restored my backup from Dropbox. Thank you for watching.